Enoch Wood. Enoch Wood and Sons. <laughs> Welcome to Over the Years. My name is Tim, and I love vintage items. I hunt for treasures and bring you the ultimate prizes of antiques, collectibles, and vintage decor. Join me, my dukes, my girlfriend Josie, and other guests as we search for history. <laughs> did you hit the red dot? I did. All right, what's up, party people? It's your boy Tim. We are here in the uh, over the years basement and we're going to show you guys some things that we picked up recently that are going to be featured on our Etsy store and eBay. Uh, we've also finally expanded. We are live. eBay, Etsy, um, Poshmark, Grailed, Macari, Depop. We are on all platforms. So the expansion is in effect. So first up. Boom. Not just one, but three of these. Pyrex butter print, Pyrex butter print bulls. So super stoked. I found all three of these in the same thrift store. So one away from the complete set. Um, they are in absolutely fabulous condition. So definitely lucked up on the Pyrex. Um, we also got this pink gooseberry Pyrex dish. So as you guys know, the gooseberry and the butter print, two of my favorites. I gotta say something. It's a ghost. Okay, go ahead. All right. This Shawnee Pottery Cornucopia Planter. Nice little salmon color. Um, we also picked up some Amberina glass. This is a Fenton Hobnail Amberina glass crimped edge compote. This bad boy right here is a Kanawha glass Amberina pitcher. And then some more of this M.A. Hadley pottery. We got two coasters. I'll probably lock these up together. And then I really, really like this. Westmoreland blue satin daisy decal on the blue satin heart plate. We also got some more plates here. This is Wedgwood Jasper Ware, Princess Diana, and Prince Charles wedding plate. Now, these <coughs> two guys are, these are antique, antique. 1800s, these plates. This is, um, I believe, the John, John Meyer. My mayor, yes, I forget how to say it, and sons. Um, this is a called the Roselle pattern, really nice. This is um European scenery by Enoch and Sons, Enoch Eno Wood, Enoch Wood, Enoch Wood, and Sons. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, yeah, so those are really nice plates, old and great condition. All right, if you want to. Slide on in here. We got a set. Oh, my favorite. Of these mid century modern glasses. And the best part is so there's seven glasses, and I have eight of these glass swizzle sticks. Mm. Mm -mm. Pretty cool stuff. Then we have some restaurant wear. This is Buffalo China. So if you don't know, Restaurant wear is actually pretty popular right now. Um, it's just that heavy duty stuff and it comes in these really interesting, you know, uh, shapes in these oval ones. They also have like cups, saucers, regular dinner plates, bread and butters, uh, luncheon plates, all that stuff. But really popular right now. Then we got this uh, Hall China set, mid-century modern. You got the teapot, the sugar, and the creamer. Some more jadeite. This is also uh, uranium glass, so this will glow in the dark. Um, I don't have the lid, but stuff is super highly collectible. Um, so pretty stoked about that. And that's made by McKee Glass. And then we got these mm. candlesticks by Duncan Miller. And they have the, um, I don't know if you can see that or not. The etching is called Salome. It's like a naked lady with a ribbon. 
Salome. Salome, my bad. <laughs> checking, checking. Good thing we have my Dukes filming. <clears throat> all right. So that's pretty much all the hard good stuff, like the glass and the china that we picked up recently. Um, so we're going to go ahead and jump into some clothes. All right. As you guys know, we have been expanding. Um, so all these clothes... You will see in our, some of them you might see in the Etsy store, uh, but primarily they'll be on eBay, Poshmark, Grailed, and Depop. So I'm just gonna go over these really quick. Here we have a nice uh, polo, green corduroy button up. Um, it is the Blake, and it's a nice big size. It is a extra large. So we'll get that steamed, cleaned, and pressed. This jacket right here, I don't know who makes it. There's no tag on it, but it is super rad. All right, and so spring is, <coughs> all right, I got it. Spring is around the corner. Um, so I'm trying to, you know, keep that in mind and pick up some sort of like, you know, pastel colors. <coughs> so I got this nice, uh, Brioni uh, dress shirt and a nice little Easter pastel color scheme. <coughs> Yellow, always a good uh, color. Good color for the spring, especially. And <coughs> whoo, this is made by Pink. And got this. All these were at really good prices. This puff vest. Super 80s, 90s, but I think 80s, more 80s, right? Uh, probably. And it's made by one, it's like Stranger Things all over. And it's got this really cool zipper with the one on it. I don't know, I thought this was really rad. It needs to be clean though, but it's pretty cool. This, made in USA, still with the tags on it. Vintage, Monte Carlo. In Vegas, sweet. And I got this Bucknell University. Also, this is a, this is a made in USA, but obviously vintage. Um, I just love the colors on that. I think those colors are really popping teal. right now. Yeah, teal. Um, this is a Ron John search shop oh, from sweet. Cozumel. Is that how you say that place? Cozumel, you got that. Got that one. <laughs> flip, this, that, flip that hood over so I can see the back again. Yeah. Ooh, nice, nice graphic on the yeah. sleeves too. Um, I think this would be super rad for streetwear, skateboarder, surfer, nice light hoodie. Perfect for the spring. Now this is uh, also vintage made in the USA. I just thought that that was a pretty cool graphic from uh, most, which I guess is like old school bank ATM card. But I just like, I, I, I like the, these corner graphics like that. They're really popular right now. So to find something vintage with a nice crisp uh, decal like that is pretty cool. This I love. Sherwin Williams. Ask all Sherwin white. Williams, is, yeah. That's how the song goes? Yeah. How does it go? Ask Sherwin Williams. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> <laughs> Big graphic on the back. Whoa. Love that sweater. This one right here is one of my favorites. It definitely needs to be cleaned, but it is vintage made in the USA from yeah. the World Cup. What year was it? 1998 World Cup. Yeah. So this shirt, this sweater is 22 years old. So yeah, pretty stoked about that find. And then... This bad boy. Look at this jacket. Satin. The red and white collar. Look at that. Mr. T's Lounge. Cool. It's pretty rad, right? Yeah. Mad wrinkles, but we're <laughs> we'll working get it on taken it. care of. But this jacket right here, one of a kind. One of a kind jacket. Super stoked about that. 
And then the last one is this uh, new with tags, uh, women's um, Ralph Lauren, Lauren active uh, vest. And I think it's reversible too. So it's pretty cool. Um, that should go pretty fast, I hope. But uh, yeah, so those are all the clothes. And we got some shoes. Gotta work on the shoes. I got these Nikes. Get those cleaned up. They're actually in really good condition. Um, so I got those. And I got some dress shoes right here. These are Joseph Abud. These are Johnston and Murphy. Um, I just like the colorways and they were in good condition, good price. And then these bad boys right here, these are Italian, made in Italy, Bruno Famagiletti. So I got those, um, these go for a lot, but I just, these people, they put these X's on the bottom and there's no, I don't know how to get them off. They mess up the bottom and you try to get them off. So just have to disclose that in the um, description. So that's uh, pretty much everything. Not everything. We got, got a whole bunch of hats, more clothes, but I'll save you guys the time. Um, so that's like a majority of the stuff we got just this last couple of days. So we're going to get all that stuff up and listed. And then I'll show you guys a video of what sold over the weekend too. But uh, thank you guys very much for checking us out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And we'll see you guys next video.